Welcome to the lab at Aka Roma. My name is Ivo Achunges. I'm the process engineer. Today in the lab, we are treating beet roots with our SEP technology to increase the yield and also to increase the nutrients in the juice. Here, as you can see from these pictures, this is the juice extracted with the SEP technology. And here is the juice extracted without the SEP technology. The difference in the juice can be seen. Here is more red and here a little bit dull. Why do we have this difference? The difference in color comes from what is sitting in the cells of beetroot and it's called betalins. It's a pigment that has a very, very strong antioxidant activity. Thereof, it's also rich in vitamin B and vitamin C. So during our test, we have seen that we increased these nutrients with, our, with the PEF, as you can see here, is more red. And also the volume, you can see we have more juice as compared to the untreated. Actually, uh, here we, have, we are showing the impact of uh, PEF on increasing the yield and also increasing the nutrients in the juice. Nowadays, uh, cold press juice has become very popular because during the cold press process, nutrients such as vitamins and antioxidants are not destroyed. With pasteurization, which is a heat treatment, there's a destruction of uh, vitamins and nutrients when we co-press, the disadvantage is that the, new, the juice is uh, on the shelf for a very short time because we still have a lot of microbes that will spoil the juice. With the PEF, we can also increase the shelf time of the juice without increasing the temperature significantly. We're talking about an increase in temperature of about 6 degrees. W meantime, the shelf time can be extended two times or twofold from five to 10 days or from five to 20 days. Mm -hmm. 